teachers and my dear friends. My name is Vũ Minh Châu. I'm from class 67, Nguyễn Văn Huy Secondary School, Booking Commune, Nhà Bè District, Ho Chi Minh City. I have the passion for reading books because reading is not only the natural stress reliever, but also enriches one's knowledge and spiritual life. Thanks to reading books, I also know a lot about many places in Nhà Bè District and Ho Chi Minh City. And one of them is Longkin Bridge, right next to the school. Have you ever heard about Longkin Bridge? So, how long and wide is it? Now, I will tell you about this bridge. Let's get started. Before the new Longkin Bridge was inaugurated, it used to be an old three meter wide bridge, which was made of iron bars. Because it was both old and small, the residents here had to deal with the traffic congestion every day. This problem with it worse during rush hours, when many people ran out to work or took their children to school. Here, where I'm standing, is Longkin Bridge. The completion of Longkin Bridge is of great significance to not only the local residents, but also the affection and determination of the leaders of the City Party Committee, Ho Chi Minh City People's Committee, Traffic Department, and Nha Bè District. The bridge is located on Levin Lung Street, connecting the two communes of Nhân Đức and Phúc Kiến. The bridge has been successfully completed with a length of nearly 380 meters, a width of 50 meters, and two lanes on each side. <coughs> the bridge received approval from the Ho Chi Minh City People's Committee in 2001. Construction started in 2018 and inaugurated on the 8th of September 2023. This means nearly two months ago. The bridge construction not only increases transportation capacity, but also plays an important role in promoting socio-economic development and improving the quality of life for the local residents in the region. Around the bridge, people also planted trees and grass bushes to decorate the bridge scenes more beautifully. Nyabe is increasingly developing and becoming more beautiful. In addition to Lumpkin Bridge, I hope that the other bridges will be built to make the moving and traffic more convenient. As a young citizen of Nyabe District, I will always study hard and try my best to practice and cultivate good qualities. Always learn and learn more about the world around me as I want to make a contribution to my hometown development and to make it a beautiful prosperous and civilized urban area. If there is an opportunity, I'd like to invite you to visit Nyabe to see how well this place is developing day by day. Thanks for your attentive listening. Nyabe, the flowing water divides us into whoever goes.